We are back if we're a little time. I might actually be able to get like so okay, so here's a real question. How far do I want to take the Archon Quest? So I'm gonna be finishing up the Archon Quest and I'm only gonna be doing the daily commissions via the Archon Quest by the sheer fact that I just need to get through them now, since I think I need to also eventually get through the Inazuma ones by the simple fact that there's inevitably going to be an event there. I'm not going to be able to deal with it. I can be able to get through it, but there's going to be an event there, and I'm not going to be able to... Oh, what is the word, you know? Be able to deal with it. Also, new 4.5 news. The fact of the weird banners of the characters that you're able to like choose a 50-50 for like a, almost a standard banner pool, but for limited 5 stars is pretty interesting. Oh, but I need to... Well, I mean, it's two days. Which isn't too bad, but... I, I still need to finish both those quests to get... Hold on. I'm just gonna get the... Alright, one, two, three, four... Well, it, it should be easy. I mean, this probably takes like 20 minutes in total actually i think only eight since it's all right i have a bunch of codes right yep oh also a preview page i'm just gonna do that real quick so i can get all the more uh... come on let me start it yep Oh, never mind, that's not much. Let me share, Reddit, because just click that and just that. That should be good. Right? No? There we go. Okay, and 300 bits of Mora, 50,000, 20,000, 71,000, some Hero's Wits, and some ref weapon refinement materials. That should be good. Actually, how close am I to getting 30k? I'm really close to getting 30k. Oh, right. The 19th from the Archon Quest, because it's been so long since I've done Archon Quest that I forget that you get free fates whenever you do that. Lame. Okay, so I'm gonna do... Oh, I haven't even done the request. Wait, actually, how long is it? Oh, two days, so... Am I... Wait, no, it's however long... Okay, 10 days left for this version entirely. But I'm going to be continuing to just farm... As much Mora as I need. Because again, Mora... Well, I mean, technically both the... <coughs> oh, sorry. <coughs> yeah. I love having like the ends of being sick still in my lungs. Hold on, uh, I blow my nose too. I mean, if there is any good news with the whole like weird new. Okay, come on, I need you to just. Okay, fine, that'll be okay. If there is any good news, I'm able to get Hunter's Path for my main account, so I can have Tainari actually have his best in slot. Good. Okay, at least for now. Oh, and I can actually enhance this. At least find it. Yep. Okay, now. And the other thing is, I'm kind of curious how my Shincho actually lines up in regards to how strong he is in regards to other Shinchos, or at least how strong the game deems that Shincho should be. Considering that it does take into account world level and anything related to that, or at least a lot of things related to that, I'm imagining it's going to be pretty strong. And even if I raise the world level by two, he's probably going to be on par, if I had to take a guess. If I had to take a guess, maybe not that good of a guess, but a guess nonetheless. Okay, so 
Yeah, so this. Should, um, wait, right. That I, I forget. The scroll wheel just camera, and sometimes I just fidget with fidget with a scroll wheel, because mine has the ability to click like on and off. Uh, I don't know what to call it, but just. And done. I do forget that with a lot of the characters that I do have now, or have built so far, pretty much are just one burst away from... Basically one burst away from finishing an entire fight. It's kind of handy, though. Oh, right, the fucking Kokugo part of the damned quest, right? Try not to enjoy this too. Yeah, the only... Blitz. Oh, that one. There we go. You know what? This one and this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Lisa's ult is really only good for bosses that tend to stay still, or at least stay in, or at least enemies that tend to stay still and aren't too spread out. One. I am easily going to have probably 200,000 adventure rank experience by the time that I'm going to want to raise the world level. And for that matter, how much Mora do I currently have? I have 8.4 million with five more runs left. More runs left. And I'm all... Okay, don't... Don't cough. Or... At least if you aren't going to cough, I'm off a little bit. You're in Hello. You've been a naughty boy. Goodbye. Come on, last one. There we go. Yeah, and we are, and I'm also getting a lot of stained masks through this, or at least illadrill masks, which is good. And I think, yep, I actually have these more being more than this for once. 69. So I am basically going to be needing to, I mean, at some point I am going to just condense all the masks I have to the highest tier just so I can have that ready since both Traveler and Ching Cho ascend with them, and I do want to be able to get that. But honestly, the bigger problem is the fact that, again, it then doubles the amount that I'm going to need for the next tier. And I just want to be able to get the full amount. Oh, come on, I can move. There we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Kind of interesting, since sometimes I I do manage to get those drops to fall underneath the... the water or the surface of the water, since they are supposed to stay on top to make sure that they don't go under. How many sweet flowers do I actually have? Want to be in this, right? Fifty-three. Okay, so I'd have I'd have plenty enough to be able to get the weekly done in terms of sweet flowers with. Come a little closer. Blitz. Yeah. 
Almost done. Come on. You can get it. No, my sword. Okay, and we are well almost good. Actually, how many two left? And also some ammo, crystal flame. Can I get I can get all three. Oh hey, maybe I can get all the ones that I can get just through on this run around. Be nice. Honestly, I just do Dawn Winery for farming these, especially with the fact that there's a place where you can get three all in one go. Right down there. Like literally like right here ish. Oh, more sweet flowers. I'll be taking you. By the way, I am glad that I did get Ching Show, and probably a good sign is fa hold on, how many is it for a character? 34. I'm almost actually halfway to getting a getting a Ray outlines your fate. Let me leave you a bird. Almost halfway to getting a at least a Bennett. Which when I get Bennett it's gonna be amazing, because again. Actually the better question is what well, I mean Shimana was just by the fact that all this counts as ultimate damage. And it'll be very good. Time to act. To hold on, is that it? Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. I felt like there'd be more. And then one left. And wait, am I able to get this all done in like eight minutes? No. Not even close. How many crystal flies do I actually have? Come on. Hold on, I'm also coughing. <coughs> I think I have a lot. 426. How much Mora? Uh, eight and a half million. I I'm going to get to 10 million Mora before I end up finishing probably this quest, since I think we're maybe about a third of the way through, or maybe like halfway through, by the simple fact that it's also the Coca Goat Body and mind. BS that we have to deal with, the Chi Chi. Anyway, why is my thumb itching like that? Either way, I'll be. Glad to just be done with and be able to get a start on an event that I... Honestly, I'll also be glad to just get a start on the fishing stuff for, like, the... Well, I mean, for the weapon that I'm going to have on Xing Cho for the rest of the account. Or the chances are for the rest of the account. Since it'll work pretty well. Or Bennett, actually. Well, uh, again, since there's the Inazuma 4-star that might be an okay match, and then there's the... Well, I mean, Bennett's, Bennett's weapon would be better with the one that you get from Sumeru. Or at least the 4-star weapon that you can get through Sumeru, not anything else, really. Lisa's weapon is pretty much going to stay the same, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. Unless if I get a 5-star catalyst from this, and I know that I am getting close to pity, or at least soft pity at the minimum. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, that's 60, 62. I have 62 pity. That's literally 13 away from the start of Soft Pity. So chances are that I'd be getting a 5-star maybe within like the next month is at least somewhat likely. Hold it out. Oh, I have 40. Yeah, so that'd be 63 with that. And that's not even taking into account the fact that I'm... Damn, you didn't even flinch that. Good job on you. Bringing actually that decent card. Hello, Rex Lapis, Morak, Zhongli. This is the cleansing bell. Hmm. 
It's in good condition. Yeah. Let's place the perfume we've prepared inside. Yep. I like how it just repeats the line. Are you also an adeptus? An adeptus. That's suspicious. But if you don't want to talk about it, we won't pry. Oh, yes. That old granny asked us to tell you something. If you have the time, you can come over for tea. I don't have much to offer, but you can always count on an old lady for a pot of tea. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> that tone does not suit you. Still, her teapot is indeed very good. There are none better for brewing tea. Yeah. When a suitable time arrives, I'll bring a spot of fine tea and pay her a visit. So mm. what's the next step in our preparation? Hmm. Next, we need to purchase kites. Ooh, Paimon loves kites! <laughs> no, no. Kites are children's toys, yes. But they also play various <coughs> symbolic roles in Liyue's rituals. Ugh, I don't like having just issues. I will explain it to you. But our next course of action should probably be to purchase the kites first. Yeah. Oh, sure. Curiouser and curiouser. I, that does not sound right. I feel like the way that you should say that would be more and more curious. That's how much it does just off of one? That's absurd. Also, why am I choosing to head down here like this? I literally have a teleport waypoint that's right there. And either way, I'm already too far into this to, com to commit to that. Yeah, literally right there. Hello. Ah, sir, you're here. The seven kites you asked for have been made to order. Would you like to take them now? Yes, thank you. Yep. It's rare to see customers who want to buy this type of kite nowadays. In the early days, we used to get orders from people of all walks of life. I is that the kite? Well, this is Mr. Zhongli from the Wong. We've talked about a whole bunch of things while traveling with him. Fashion, economy, jewelry, and jade pottery. He seems to know Liyue's favorite topics, money and government, really well. But he likes talking about- Well, that's because I prefer to share fun things with you. <laughs> <laughs> Children's toys are very fun things, that's for sure. I enjoy watching the children at play as much as anyone else. But I've only been streaming for like 18 minutes? Oh, I might be able to finish the- I might be able to literally finish Leeway's quest. Finely crafted toys are well loved by children, but this craft itself has been honed over thousands of years, and there is meaning behind that. Yeah. Why is the shadow just a rectangle? I have made kites in Liyue for 40 years, and I am intimately familiar with the forms oh passed God. down from my ancestors. <coughs> the meaning of these seven kites is God, far from the now. Indeed. These are decorations used in the rite of parting. The seven kites represent the seven. Yeah. You know, it'd be kind of interesting to actually see the kites. I took the liberty of coloring outside the lines when doing the insignia of the Animo Archon. Mm. As for the kite that honors the Geo Archon, one must follow the contract given right down to the last letter. These patterns are ancient, and you can also find them in the Golden House. I I'm not surprised. Ah, Paimon's her dad name, huh? The design of this kite displays a firm grasp on the cyclicality and eternity so dear to the Electro Archon. Yeah, and again, the worst Archon out of everyone. Le legitimately the worst possible. I I'm going to get more into that, but again, it's just... I don't, I don't like Raiden Shogun or A or whatever the fuck. It's just dumb. These markings of tree and leaf pay due honor to wisdom and the passage of time all this on a single kite truly astonishing yes justice flows across the surface of the waters 
War rages like a flame. As does that which... <laughs> the compliments of a learned man truly are pleasant. Well then, Gregor mm -hmm. Shen. I shall take these back with me. Well, allow me. Oh, thank you for the payment. Anyway, we're probably gonna just fight you, like, maybe either today or tomorrow. I don't know. Did you arrange to meet here? <laughs> no, I was merely passing through. Hell of a coincidence. I see Mr. Zhang Li's the same as ever. When paying, well, when getting others to pay for him, he neither looks at the price tag nor his wallet. Yeah. He knows a great deal about money and about the trials of the common man. He just doesn't consider poverty to be something that could ever happen to him. Or perhaps you could say that he cannot imagine himself lacking money. Yes, I know what you're implying. I've been saying this for like the past two streams. How has he not died of hunger yet? <laughs> Child, you are as fond of jokes as ever. Well then, the right of parting requires helping hands as well as materials. We should be able to find some people near the harbor. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, take this bag of money. You probably won't want to let Zhang Li do the bargaining, if you know what I mean. Very intimate, but yes, hmm. I know what you mean. Seems I missed out on some interesting information. You didn't miss out on shit, really. I suppose I'll just have to find a more opportune moment next time. Like, unless if you were talking about when me and Zhang Li were up at the actual or, like site where we're doing the parting, right of parting, you didn't miss, miss much. Hello? Hiring help? Sure. But let me just say first that I'm a reserve member of the Adventurers Guild. I take adventuring commissions, but I don't do anything. Adventure? Venturing into the. Eh? That's not hard. Almost a bit too easy for a reserve. A most fair price. Let's negotiate. You can do it singular. Can you hold it? Down? Yes, you can. Okay, so I'm gonna go. Hold on. Uh, actually, hold on. Uh, let me go. Sure, that'll be good. Five geo crystal flies. Yes, I do think it's worth about this much. I'll do it. Okay. And hello. A full day of odd jobs at Eugene Terrace. Hmm. No problem. Twenty-five. Whoa, that's expensive. Hero of monster. Well, you may never have heard of this hero, but it seems. Let's talk prices. Twenty. Jesus Christ. Anyway, mood. So let's just see twenty thousand. Nineteen. Let's see about nineteen. Sure. Hey, that's a good price. Anyone would work for this much, Mora. Oh, so I could have absolutely low lowballed it a lot more. And now let's take a gander at what you can. Oh, help! Sure. I tick. So what's the job? Let me see. We are still missing some wooden. No problem. That'll be twenty thousand more. Done. This is all you got, child? Uh, no, no, no. He's putting up the money. Thou still no. Th th wouldn't that mean I have to make two trips? How about this? Let's make a trade. Get me a single chinkson flower, and I'll consider that payment for a detour to find this child. Yes, we've got no choice. That'll be fine. I I'm literally assuming. Hold on. Have you brought the good? Hey, that's pretty good. These things are pretty rare, and I have no idea where I'd find them. Okay, hold on. I I'm I'm dumb. It's chasing flower. flower. I should be able to pacify my daughter tonight. Eh, okay. I mean. Again, it is really dumb that you still haven't managed to remember 
Oh yeah, I should probably make myself a trust fund of Mora to last me decades. But okay. Finished then? Splendid. Any leftover? You think you can buy us off with some loose change? <laughs> well, how does this sound? You give me the information. What info do you need? Paimon, you're a dumb fucking thing, and I wish, I wish main character would actually be a goddamn main character and speak up instead of fucking you because you're just a shit huh. does that mean you know what he's after paimon we witnessed the fatui assault a god i'll see your wings are turning red or have red in them Oh my god, can you not be so fucking dumbfounded <laughs> and idiotic? You both need to calm down. I don't know what's gotten into you. Just what is this about? The atmosphere. <laughs> it's fine. Next, we need some everlasting incense. For this, we is everything okay? Yes. Everything is fine. I was just informing. Now, if you'll excuse me. <clears throat> Tickled, tackled, and toad. Weijong. Oh, right, and that's also this. And with that, I have the... This done, so I can just teleport to here. Actually, what am I doing? I'm literally right next to a... Actually, how much more do I have currently? Uh, 8.6 million. That's a good amount. Also, again, it is a bit infuriating that this is still dialogue that happens. It's like, oh wow, we can't skimp a single Mora because we're so poor, yet we have 8.6 million in the bank. Thank you oh for god, sorry. Today. Yep, thank you. Yep. In here, well, we can't do that. Well, I can do that, but I'm not going to do that. I'm still going to get eight chests, but I'm going to leave that for later since I don't need to do them in here. Why am I running there? I could literally teleport like 200 meters at least closer. Hello. Oh. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Ah yes, and the first Dendro character to be shown, and probably the longest time. Oh right, Chi Chi. Damn it! Triggers from out here. The reception is deserted, and it seems kind of spooky in here. Okay, I could literally see Chi. Also, these are way too big for a normal apot. Are these like apothecary drawers with like sectioned out? That wouldn't work. Why? Okay, but how would you? I'm, I'm nitpicking a video game logic. I'm nitpicking a video game logic. Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. Hello, Chi Chi. The reception, it seems. How about... Yep. Okay, then just continue the scene. Don't just have me need to walk like a foot forward. Hello. That's probably the most expression I've seen on a character so far. She does not me. Ah, Paimon thinks you might be right. Look at the talisman on her forehead. Yep. Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. I am Chi Chi. Yep. Once upon a time, Chi Chi died. Then, Chi Chi was saved by the Adepti. Now, Chi Chi is a zombie. Such a nonchalant delivery for a bombshell revelation. Something like this would be unimaginable in Mondstadt. Well, I mean, Venti is kind of just the god of death over there, so... Makes sense. Uh, hello, little girl. Do you sell everlasting incense here? I know for a fact you're one of the Adepti who literally had to resurrect her, so... Makes sense why you sound a bit hesitant. Excuse me, sir. I... 
Surely no prescription is needed to purchase everlasting incense. It's not a controlled substance. You're talking to a zombie. I don't think... Chi-Chi can get your medicine. But only if you show... Zombies are limited to acting within the confines of their orders. And somehow in this case, the zombie issues her own orders to herself. Well, it's convenient. My dear Chi-Chi, we didn't bring a prescription, I'm afraid. Okay, then. How did you manage that? But Chi-Chi helps you. Since when do customers need to do favors for customer service staff? Never mind. Just think of it as a peer-to-peer -peer transaction. That way, everybody wins. Sometimes in Liyue, the art of the deal is simply about victory via mental gymnastics. Okay. Go to Mount Tianhong, find the Guizhong Ballista, and hunt a cocoa goat. Please and thank you. Hunt the what with the witch at where? Hmm. Guid it's a kind of crossbow turret. Installed on Mount located in Tianhong Pass, it was designed to automatically fire at large monsters, protecting Liu. Mr. Zhang Li really knows Liu inside out. Okay. Apparently not quite. This is the first I have ever heard of the Coco Goat. The Coco Goat is a legend. Did you want to add anything? No. Just that the what it looks like. Don't know. Where to find it? Don't know either. Do tell us Where if you remember from? anything else you don't remember. Also because the dumb know. part is, is, it's like, oh yes, I want to get some coconut milk because that sounds nice. But guess what? We, you could have just said why you needed it. Very well then. Let's start by investigating. <sighs> what the heck is it? Like, the simple fact is, if you're just asked, hey, why do you need a cocoa goat? It's like, oh, I want coconut milk. Oh, oh yeah, it's a simple mistake. So basically, coconut milk is made from coconut. And then that part, this part of the quest would have been done. But no, we need to introduce Ganyu into the story before the final climax. This is supposed to be the build-up, but it's not that much of a build-up, considering that a lot of shit is happening, right? It's huge! Paimon can totally believe it took an Adeptus to build this! What do you mean? It's literally just a giant ass crossbow on something that can turn around and swivel. This does not look that impressive. Wait, how do you operate this thing? Just think how much strength you would need. Well, if you can see this, the... wait, what? Why are these planks here? Hmm. Yeah. Oh, what? After a millennia of wear and tear. Even Adepti contraptions are difficult to maintain. So what are yeah. we gonna do? Quick, Mr. Johnny, use your unlimited high society knowledge powers! You could just say Adeptus powers since he has just more acts and I don't think... It's really getting annoying to just walk around the bush this much. We've done 20 laps at the minimum. Hmm. You almost make it sound like I'm some sort of bourgeois parasite whose only utility lies in providing quaint pieces of trivia on demand. I mean, at this point, you are. That said, let me think for a moment. As I recall, there is a military supply po- If we can retrieve the spare parts from where they are stored, we- So, what you're saying is that you act- I have a smattering of knowledge on the topic. Okay. With the parts in hand, I could at least tinker with it. Supply post. Here, post. This world is full of unsolved. I am saying this a bit late, but sorry for if if yeah. there is any ability for. Is this an answer from this world? Ah. I have nothing left. 
Okay, that should be good. Oh, anyway. Takes a full second for the cutscene to kick in. These parts one moment. I will try to repair the device. It is done. The Guizhong Ballista is more intricately designed than I thought. Ooh. Now how do we turn it on? I mean, this entire thing is made out of wood and metal. You aren't turning it on, you're gonna be it's basically moving it. We simply need to do this. Look. It e over here we have nothing. And over Hey! Just what do you think you're doing? Hello. So you fixed up this turret. Not a turret. A Guizhong Ballista. Huh. Are you blind or something? This area is supposed to be chock full of hidden treasures. But you can't get anywhere near them with this thing keeping watch. Huh. It might look like last time we approached the mountain, it nearly skewered one of our guys. That's kind of impressive because it didn't even have a drawstring functional. A few of us risked our lives to disarm it, which amazingly... The next thing you'll be rep... Tut, tut. Vandalizing the legacy of an... It is not we who need reprimand. Well, I mean, that and I'm pretty sure this is preserved. Anyway. No, my sword. Also, you ain't shit for someone who says that they're the literal... Body and mind. The hunter becomes time to act. Witness the power. Done. Done. Almost. Is that it? No, one more. Oh, um. And done. Huh. These little lights didn't Troubling ourselves over this rabble is not worth it. Oh yeah, that! A search using the Guizhong Ballista revealed no significant life forms nearby, save for the usual wildlife. What's more, a contraption built using Adeptus technology should have no trouble detecting an Adepta beast, as Chi Chi put it. That would just still be Adeptus. <sighs> Which means. Repairing this is a complete waste of time. I wouldn't go that far. <sighs> we won't solve it. Good idea. We did our best. And Kaching, right? No? Oh, wait, no. Wait, does it take nowhere near as long as I thought this was, or is it just that I. Okay, why did the screen fade black like that? I don't think that was supposed to happen. If that was supposed to happen, i am done something wrong. I'm hoping I'm not breaking it. Hello, Chi-Chi, you shit. Forgive us. We were unable to fulfill our... <sighs> What a disappointment. Aw, poor Chi Chi. Why does Paimon feel so guilty all of a sudden? What do you need this cocoa goat cocoa for? Cocoa goat milk is tasty. I'm sorry. I have a. Ah, here. This is the name. Huh? Oh. I owe you both an apology. I hastily agreed to what. Never mind, Zhang Li. You didn't know. As a... Excuse me, everyone. Did Chi Chi say a bad thing? No, it's a misunderstanding. Oh. Sorry, but Paimon's gonna leave the job of shattering this poor kiddo's world to you. It's time to tell you where coconut milk comes from. It all begins with the fruit of a coconut tree. Oh. It seems Chi Chi took this pretty hard. She just needs time to work through it. <laughs> Someone learnt a valuable life lesson today, then. Thank you all for looking after my little Chi-Chi. 
Hello, Baiju. Might I ask who? Ah, oh, how rude of me. I'm Baiju, boss of the Boo Boo Pharmacy. Also, take into account the other characters. It's really lucky you didn't have Hu Tao trying to bury Chi Chi again. I meant that Chi Chi was the boss. <laughs> Turns out it's some wacko who wears medicinal ingredients around his neck. What around his neck is medicinal? The snake? What a sorry state of affairs. This little mascot is even more of a simpleton than Chi Chi. Ah, the medicine. The snake is speaking. Okay, did you think the snake was medicine? How? Uh, nothing that really surprises me much. I prefer to stay silent, but faced with strangers, I must speak, lest you mistake me for an escapee from the medicine cabinet, for I am a living, breathing serpent! Yes. <laughs> Don't mind Chung Sheng. She's a good girl, really. As for you three, communal chaos causing with Chi Chi aside, what business brings you here? Oh, you know, everlasting incense. Do you sell everlasting incense in this fine establishment? Everlasting incense? Why, of course we do. Oh, at last. Things are Three million more. Top quality. Guaranteed. Might as well rob the bold oh, golden it's house. Too bad that Chi-Sing have taken it all. Hmm. Three million. It's a crazy number. We'd never be able to make that much more of. <laughs> this is correct. No shame. What are we gonna do? Is this the part where we go crawling back to child? No. <laughs> Coco goat. Coco goat. <laughs> my sides hurt. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe you fell for that. I'm not surprised. Hey, less laughter. <laughs> I'm almost in tears over here. Uh, thank you. That was the best laugh I've had in a long time. In return, I'm... Excuse me, sir. Dr. Baiju, isn't it? Truly honored. I'm... If Ubu Pharmacy needed a stable supply of, say, coconut milk... Strange. I knew the Fatui infiltrated business... Coconut milk. Baiju, quick. Chi-Chi wants coconut milk. What? Ah, yes, of course, Chi-Chi. Anything you want. That's like... Zero... Hmm. Well, now that this is settled... We must head back to Yujing Terrace. Mr. Child, Dr. Baiju, little Miss Chi Chi, see you soon. I mean, the simple fact that even with the amount of more that I currently have, that's still an absurd number, is concerning. Ah, that lot is an absolute riot. So, you've been eavesdropping, I hope. What have I missed? Not a whole lot. Yes, Master Child. They spoke of the Qixing taking the Golden House. Well, well, well. Ningguang and her Qixing cronies. What else would they be hiding in the Golden House, if not the Exuvia? Wait, you just figured that out. It's been literal days. I apologize, but I warned you, didn't I? As the old Leo is saying goes, the walls have ears. How the fuck did you manage to not know that that was there? You know, the fact that the bank probably has twice as more security, or like, probably half a dozen other indicators besides just, ah yes, you fool, you talked about the secret thing, when it's kind of not a secret exactly, if it ends up being the whole government needs to scramble to hide it, to the point where expecting cultural heritage. Anyway, uh, yeah, that's too far, I'ma just, uh, do a simpler version of that. <laughs> oh god. No, I probably shouldn't eat in that protein bar. What time is it? I've been streaming for almost an hour already. And I'm pretty sure I'm getting pretty close in to the end of this. Oh my god. Oh wait, but I'm gonna have to do the terrace bullshit, aren't I? Well, that's part three, not part two. I remember part two taking an annoying amount of time, so... Well, as it stands, we've hired helpers, and we've acquired the everlasting incense. The completion of our preparations is not far off. Oh, <laughs> well, traveler, have you gained anything from our adventure so far? It's been odd. Odd. I'm not sure if we've been experiencing living the high life or experiencing the struggles of the poor. <laughs> 
Which is it, I wonder? Yes. The questions that such travels raise are ever so complicated. Not really. Well, I'll leave you to ruminate over it yourself. That's not much As debate going on. As for your help, I've decided to treat you to a meal. That you've paid for? Ah, oh. uh, yes, don't worry. I will remember to bring the Mora this time. Okay, so you flat out are acknowledging that you're probably just materializing Mora in your back pocket right now. Make enough so that you don't have to worry about not being a god. Tonight, I shall take you both to an old hole in the wall, praised throughout Leo. Hole eh? in the wall? As in a... <laughs> Indeed. Let us meet near the harbor at third round knockout. Okay. Oh, okay, so just wait until nightfall. Yep. Actually, hold on. Achievement. Yep. Oh, and notices as well. Should probably get through those. Okay, let's just game update. Okay. Oh, wait, third round knockout was right next to this. So again, just do that before I feel too invested in gliding to there. Hold on. Why the... Okay, that's interesting. Since I can just literally go like that without much issue at all. Ah, you're here. There's no need to order. I've already done so. Okay. Third round knockout is not for lightweights, like those taverns in Mondstadt. Here, the owner does not take such unorthodox orders as fruit juice. So, does this mean I can order wine this I time? I ordered some wine-fermented sweet rice balls for you, if that counts. I guess I should have expected this. If it is to your liking, dear customers, I shall continue the tale of Lady Mingguan's Jade Chamber. Okay. Hey, there's even a storyteller here. Great atmosphere. Besides fine wine, the excellent ambiance is the reason why this place is so well loved. Yeah. And notice how that person was still speaking while we've been speaking, but with no sound coming out. But when I say ambiance, I refer to a different sort from the one the Tevat Travel Guide uses to judge other establishments. As you all know, high above the land of Liyue lies a pavilion in the clouds, a palace in the mist. What does it mean to have all-seeing eyes? This, my friends, Lady Ningguan's masterwork that bridges earth and sky. Imagine. The weather is clear, and you gaze down from the deck on the world below. There... Hi. Regardless, it is kind of funny just the fact that there's just this platform that has a mansion on it with no safety rails on the front half of the mansion. So if anything does happen, like wind picks up, something is just a bit too light, it just all goes falling down. Behold, the glorious sights of Liyue Harbor. Stretching out far and wide. Are you actually keeping watch from there? Since, if I'm not mistaken, we're both like right about here, but we're probably out of render distance, which is why the tree's here. They say that when Lady Ningguang ponders important affairs, Animated she cut retreats scene. to her jade chamber with none but her three closest confidants in tow. Why brings she these trusted three to sift through sources, dig through documents, looking for information? Piece by piece, facts and figures paint a picture on the walls of the chamber. But well before the wall is filled, Lady Ningguang's mind is made up. Having made her call, she has every last document shredded, and whoosh, she scatters the shavings out her window. Ah, oh, look at them. How they billow in the wind like a sudden swirling blizzard. As the fragments fall, traces of text flicker before the eyes of the merchants of Liyue. Yeah. Like ink stains and white snow. The saying goes, 
The rarest treasures in the land are the words brought by the paper snow. For the words of the Tianquan have the power to move mountains, and all throughout the land know it. These are but scraps of paper, and yet they guide Lady Ningguang's hand. Such is their value. Okay, I have a night. I am almost confident that none of that would happen because chances are if you just shredded a piece of paper like that in a way that you could put them together without much difficulty, they would be burned before that. Merely grasping one or two of them will surely gift you a fragment of her wisdom. Enough to stay a step or two ahead of your peers. Oh god, and then there's also the fatuity. Well, I mean, that's all probably quest three. Feels like we're hearing this name a lot. Yes, because she's basically the top president now. Really, locals talk about her. The Fatui hate her. She's most likely the one who hid the Exuvia, and we saw her at the Rite of Dissension. And you're saying this without giving a shit. Huh. Paimon wonders what sort of person she is. Ambitious. At last, I have found you. You who returned from Juayun Karst. Oh, Ganyu. Why, why Paimon we gotta go, though? Wait, I am not with the Millilith, nor am I here to claim your bounty. I still have a bounty? How the fuck? However, I am an emissary of the Leo Achising. My name is Ganyu, secretary at the Yuahai Pavilion, and I have come specifically to meet you. Secretary? In concrete terms, I am the corporate secretary for the Chising. At the moment, I am serving as Lady Ningguang's special emissary. Ah. Uh. Ningguang sent you? We were literally just talking about her. I mean, you say that like Ningguang probably doesn't have doesn't have like half the entire population of this city and maybe even country on her payroll. My apologies, you who have returned from Jiayu and Karst. I am duty bound and cannot extend my courtesy to you in full. Okay. But I have with me a letter from Lady Ningguang. She extends a formal invitation to you in her capacity as Tianquan. Okay. She invites you to her palace in the sky. An official invitation? Lady Ningguang said this. Invite him to come here. Okay. I wish to meet him. At the Jade Chamber, together we shall snip every one of these entwining dark threads. I mean, it does make sense we'd meet with the president. And there's that quest done. And with that, the emissary who called herself Ganyu just disappeared. It's also kind of funny that they had to make the traveler re-sit down. But we've received an invitation from the Leo at Chising. Paimon still can't believe it. We'll be yeah. meeting people that have way more money than Paimon could ever count. We should be on our best manners. I always mind my manners. Paimon is up to something again. <laughs> An invitation to visit the Jade Chamber is a rare honor indeed. I don't know, I'll be able to teleport it for probably about a day until it gets destroyed. You'd best be on your way now. But don't forget about the rite of parting. Once you've finished at the Jade Chamber, meet me at Dihua Marsh. Okay. Don't worry, we won't forget. Dihua Marsh. Yep. A new star approaches. The big thing. Actually, am I able to do the event now or no? No, I have to f new start first. Got oh, and then also I got this guide. Yep, and that's twenty total wishes. Twenty total wishes. Okay, and right, no constellation. That's E five. Then E six is going to be gained. History has something to say. Oh, wait, no, I can do this, right. I, oh, that was the thing I wanted to unlock. Oh, and I can basically get the first version of... Wait, how much of... How much of the exploration have I done? Have I done enough to get the first level? Hello, you are the person I'm going to be talking to quite a lot. Yep. Oh my god, I've already almost completed the... Yep, uh, reputation... Uh, hold on. 
not claim them all. Alright, that's two. Complete a new search approach just for requests. And that is the first one being golden shrimp balls. And this one, which is. Oh. Oh, damn it, that's three. Okay, that. Uh. uh long home hail, extra res decreased, damage for plunging crack. Invulnerable while it's overload. Yeah, so I might just end the stream off here. Yes, yeah, it stays comfortably under about an hour. One, two, three. Oh, and honestly, how about, uh, how about I actually just use some of the... It's a bit weird how you can only hold five at a time of those, but you're able to hold... Well, because it's, it's spendable, that doesn't expire. That's the thing. Actually, that's that'd be true for the resin. The only difference is that this refills, so you basically need to continue. Why is there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be teleporting up there. I'm just going over to check the shop and probably just ending this. What? All oh, right, event details. Since we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, and this is all in the... Not that one, the map, it's all in... What's it called? Dupa Papa Gorge. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. I don't know what, how I would be, but I probably am. Wow. Actually, hold on. Can I just... Let's just get that one out of the way. Yep, and still, actually I am starting to get kind of far into this, not to mention we have just a free polearm, catalyst, claymore, and bow. Don't have a free sword. Uh, well, either way, I'll pretty much be good. So, yeah. Hold on, uh, can I find like a good backdrop to end? Wait, hold on, I know. Damn it, I'm okay. Yep, anyway, thank you to anyone who uh Okay, no, I need to you. Anyway, uh thank you to anyone who decided to come in and watch the stream. Thank you to anyone viewing on YouTube. Good morning, good day, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Whichever suits you most.